Hello everyone, this is Happy Nian. Recently, Hurricane Ida made landfall in the southern U.S. Louisiana. The extreme weather caused severe flooding in Tonson cities, left hundreds of thousands of customers without power and caused serious injuries. Welfare drought flooding, the U.S. has been hit by multiple weather disasters this summer. In recent years, extreme weather has been occurring across the U.S., and the climate crisis is becoming increasingly acute. According to an article in the New York Times, from Hurricane Ida to the California wildfires, these disasters have revealed a potential crisis in the U.S. The U.S. is not ready for the extreme weather. During the Obama administration, Alice Hill, who was in charge of climate policies at the National Security Council, said, the United States is not prepared for these events. Five years later, after an entire summer of extreme weather, the current president Joe Biden again said, we need to be better prepared year after year, not prepared, not ready. The U.S. poor climate crisis response uses the safety of the American people as a bargaining chip for trail. According to NBC on September 4th, in New York and New Jersey, at least 42 people died due to the Hurricane Ida. After the severe flooding caused by Hurricane Sandy in 2012, the New York City government invested $2.6 billion in flood protection, but these so-called enhanced food protection projects were still too vulnerable to Hurricane Ida. The White House is having trouble prescribing a cure for extreme weather. After a threat of disasters such as droughts, wildfires, and floods, the U.S. government is still begging for help in passing a climate-related budget bill. Without an Acting any substantive bills. The Foreign Policy wrote an article on the September 3rd, criticizing that even though natural disasters are happening every day, political factors will continue to hinder the formation of concrete solutions. Some key U.S. legislators for even the first steps needed to address environmental issues. Okay, this is opinion. See you next time. Bye bye.